Hey guys, Brian with Keres, and in this video I'll be doing the video overview of Samsung's Keys Air application for the Galaxy S. Um, as you can see, this is the browser activated side of the application. And what it lets you do is a look at your phone's contacts, messages, photos, music, videos, call log, ringtones, and bookmarks. So uh, as you can see, those are all listed right here. And when you click on those, for example, if you go to contacts, it'll bring up your contacts pane. And it will show you, you can ed edit what it's listed by, names or favorites. Um, as you can see, I have 22 pages of them. You can search for your contacts here, and you can also edit them. So, pretty simple stuff, but um, lets you edit contacts a lot faster than doing it manually through your phone. Uh, if you go to Messages, it shows you all your conversations, and you can also delete them from here as well. And you can listen by inbox, sent box, drafts, and outbox. If you go to Photos, it'll give you a list of all the photos that are stored on your phone. So that could be anything from skins and screenshots to camera photos. And you can upload those from here as well. And music is much the same thing. Uh, and the cool thing about this is it actually has a music player built in as well. So if you're using a computer that doesn't have a, a media player, you can actually just go ahead and sync up with your with your Galaxy S phone using Keys Air and play any uh, media off of that instead so pretty nifty feature right there and if we go here we can see videos I haven't really taken that many but you can also upload them via this program as well through the Wi-Fi this is another good solution in case you're missing your micro USB cable call log uh, this gives you an overview of your calls made if you want to check out who you've been calling Ringtones. Alright, so you can set different ringtones from this page. Um, let's see here. We just did a review on five different applications that are free applications on the internet market that allow you to make ringtones. So a bunch of these are remnants of that. You can download these ringtones to your computer from Keys Air, or you can set them as your ringtone from the computer and bookmarks. I don't think I have any, right? I don't have any, but the default one. You can manage those from there. Now, another interesting thing that you can do with Keys Air is uh, you can actually create text messages from here. Let's see if I can figure out. You can definitely reply. Let's see if I can go to the text section. I don't have a mouse here. Alright, messages. Right, you can go to new right here, and then you can type in the appropriate contact name, and you can send a text message through your computer. Pretty nifty if you need to send multiple text messages or a long text messages, as a keyboard makes that much faster than typing with the, uh, uh, a soft keyboard on the uh, Galaxy S. So that's an overview of uh, Samsung's Keys Air program for you. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please visit our website at www.carries.net. Have a good one.